Okay, hi guys. Uh, today we're going to learn how to calculate your OT pay using Google Sheets. In Google Drive, you right click, you open Google Sheets. First thing you should do is to always uh, rename it. So let's say we use OT pay. Then you want to add in those basic things that you usually would take notice of for uh, calculating OT pay. At the date that you have to OT, uh, if you're being particular, you can add the day as well the time because you're calculating what time you OT so you can, for this right normally you can just put the uh, time out or time time that you're supposed to go home okay not of time okay but uh, you're calculating calculating the OT time so time you left you can rename anything you like but for convenience sake I'm just gonna use this after that your OT hours I will select the whole row and then bold it, uh, create one line, and next is to centralize everything. This is just my my doing whenever I do all these Google Sheets thing with the headings. Let's say on the 10th of May, you, you had your first OT. So 10th May 2020 was a Sunday. Let's say you are supposed to work until 2 p.m. that day. But the actual time that you left uh, your workplace was at 2.40 because it was busy Sunday. So coming to calculate your OTP, what you can do right is equal what time you leave, okay, what time you left, sorry, minus away the time that you're supposed to go enter. Okay, it gives you a weird timing, but don't worry, it's just format. Okay, what you can do now is to format it, numbers, select duration. Okay, but you can see that there is uh, a, lot of, a lot of zeros there, and it's very confusing for you. This is because it shows the hour, the minute, and the seconds. Again, you can format this. Okay, go to numbers. Under more format, you go for date and time. Delete this one. Okay, and there's the two dot dot there. You might also want to delete it because if not, it will reflect. So apply. And there you have it. 40 minutes. You work extra 40 minutes. Or oh, aesthetics. I will always put it everything in the center. I'll give you another example. Okay. So again, you don't have to key in one by one the equal, then the time you left minus the knock of time. What you can do is you come to this, the last one, the latest one. Okay, at the bottom right, when you put at the corner, there's this cross. And what you want to do is just hold and drag down. There you have it. You work extra one hour, 20 minutes uh, yesterday. OT. My suggestion is you can do everything first before you tidy up the aesthetics. So coming here, let's say you want to calculate everything that you OT for the month. Okay, again, this is just my preference. Okay, you come to this row OT hours, right? To calculate everything here, you just put equal, sum, open bracket. Okay, select the from the beginning where you want to start your uh, the calculation of this total you press shift and press the last one and then you can close the bracket and enter there you have it you work two hours extra okay again aesthetics okay so that's how you calculate your OT pay without having to calculate one by one using the calculator thank you for watching